Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. My name is Seth, and today's public service announcement is dedicated to your fears. This program is brought to you by The Salvation Project. And what fear are we going to be discussing today? That's right, Satanism. Satanism is a great danger to our citizens, and we all should be on our toes. It's a danger to our souls, to our world, and our way of living. And this danger strikes where it hurts most, our children. To make sure your kids are safe, you should locate the satanic objects in your household before it's too late. The typical satanic object includes satanic audio tapes, satanic posters, or satanic books. Beware, these can be hidden in plain sight. And on that, we wish your family luck in searching and destroying the threats inside your home. Be careful, because if you don't care, they will. This has been a broadcast from The Salvation Project. Until next time, Seth out. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome! My name is Seth, and today's public service announcement is dedicated to energy consumption. 
This program is brought to you by The Salvation Project. So, as we previously stated, energy consumption is an extremely important issue. However, sometimes we have to ignore it to protect ourselves from the evils of the world. As you all know, Satanism has started to rapidly grow in our communities. Since our last program, many of our viewers relate to us their successes of protecting their house from the devil's propaganda. But that is not enough. As Jeremiah 29.11 says, For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans for welfare and not for evil, to give you a future and a hope. The devil comes at the devil's hour. But using science, our specialists discovered that the correct time of the devil's hour is 8 p.m. The devil fears the light. Even the smallest darkness can bring the devil. So we shall shine the light on it and bring safety to our homes. We implore you, turn on every light in your home until 8 p.m. and make your house safer. Be careful, because if you don't care, they will. This was a Salvation Project program. Until the next time, Set out. Well, hello there, missus. I believe you found yourself in a bit of a situation. Why? Missus, this is an emergency. And a big one, I might say. I came here to help you get rid of the demons in your home. I see you've been watching my programs and following them. Even if you are afraid of spiders, now you know there are things that are much worse than that. Satan is very much real and is nearing your home. Perhaps you noticed the signs already. The lights, your son's behavior, and however more that you don't notice. And I am here to help you with the protection of your home. Silly, I am helping everyone. I've already helped countless people, and you are just another lucky child of God who gets the special treatment. But hush now. It was hard for your nerves today already. Go to sleep now. I will guard it with my life. 
After you wake up, there is much to be done. Welcome, everyone! My name is Seth, and today's public service announcement is dedicated to the signs of Satan in your house. This program is brought to you by The Salvation Project. As you should know, the devil is coming! And we should all be protecting ourselves and our loved ones from the devil. Check your windows! Check your windows! Board them up! Board them up! Satan shall not pass! Check your crosses! Make sure they are not inverted! Check your mirrors! Cover them up! Satan shall not pass! Satan shall not pass! Be careful, because if you don't care, they will. This was a Salvation Project program. Until next time, set out! What a charmer, huh? Sure is an energetic fella. But he is right. You should get on your feet and start covering them windows. Maybe check your garage for instruments and materials. You're bound to have something. I also remember you having a cross in here nearby, as well as a mirror in your room. So what are you waiting for? Go, go, go!
I see you have completed your mission. And most importantly, you are still alive. I am not insensitive. I'm just doing my job. And my job is to keep you safe. Mrs. You should not anger the one who gives you salvation! You look tired. You should go to sleep. Go. To. Sleep. Hey there, missus! I see you're back again for the Daily Wisdom! You are under attack! Your life is under attack! Your soul is under attack! We have to go for the nuclear option! You have to call for help! Luckily, our manager knows the correct ritual to summon a guardian angel for your home! Do it! Now! Do it! Now! Focus now. Get the chalk and candles from storage. Lighter from the kitchen and DON'T forget the lighter! The storage room is right across the corridor. Then, and only then, get back to me, and we'll begin the ritual. That's it! Now draw the sacred pentagram, and place the candles on the edges of the Forsaken Star. The Lord demands it! The Lord is coming! Yes! Yes! Now the time has come! Your soul will be ours! The Salvation Project, it is finally completed! The Hollow Star has awakened, and you were its originator! Perish, you naive wench, and succumb to the will of our Dark Lord! Thank you. 